Many people, especially those who are black, indigenous, brown, and older adults, lack access to healthy foods and have higher rates of diet-related illnesses. Communities are often overrun with liquor stores and convenience stores, but don't have access to grocery stores or have the ability to grow their own foods. Food Empowerment Project calls this food apartheid instead of food deserts, since these areas lack foods such as fruits and vegetables because of racism, ageism, and classism. This occurs when corporations deliberately impact access to healthy foods, and when city buses don't run regularly and limit how many bags a person can bring on board. These are deliberate and systematic attempts to harm the health of black, brown, and indigenous people. Solutions must start with listening to what the community sees as ways to remedy the situation, such as more urban gardens, supporting people growing their own foods, worker-owned cooperatives, and living wages. Everyone deserves the right to access healthy, culturally appropriate foods that allow them to eat their ethics and lead healthy lives.